Consider disc of mass 5 kg, radius 2 meter, rotating with angular speed 10 radian per second, about an axis perpendicular to the plane of the rotation. An identical disc is kept gently over the rotating disc along the same axis. The energy is dissipated so that both the discs continue to rotate together. Now, if I have to calculate the initial energy, I will write half i omega square. It is half i is known as the for the disc half mr square into omega square so it is 1 by 4 mass is 5 kilogram radius is 2 square that is 4 omega is 10 square that is 100 so initial energy is given by 500 joule now what is the final energy finally there are two discs identical so you can say half i omega square plus half i omega square but omega will change this is omega 2 and this is I say omega 1 okay like this now what is omega 2 we all know conservation of angular momentum i1 omega 1 equal to i2 omega 2 i1 is given by only one disc so half mr square omega 1 is given to us that is 10 radian per second i2 it is a combination of the two disc so half mr square plus half mr square it is mr square and omega 2 we have to calculate so mr square cancel omega 2 is known as 5 so finally we will calculate a final is given by half i i is the moment of inertia again it is half mr square into omega 2 square omega 2 square means 5 square is 25 then again same quantity so we can multiply by the 2 so what we will calculate it is 1 by 2 mass is given to us that is 5 kilogram radius is given to us that is 2 so 2 square here is 4 into 25 so it is 2 to the 4 5 to the 10 it is 250 joule so initial energy 500 final energy 250 joule so we will say energy dissipated is 250 joule so right answer is 250 250 joules